Hey YouTubers, I want to tell you about the GoPlus Folding 2 inch trailer hitch shank mount cargo wheelchair carrier adapter 500 pounds uh, that I purchased from Amazon. Uh, now you can see the product here that they've advertised and uh, I really this is perfect this is what I wanted it arrived today and I want to give you a quick review of the product so basically it the receiver hitch is in two pieces and the two inch receiver section uh, can fold up so it's out of the way and you save space uh, from it sticking out the back of your vehicle but I like the option of actually uh, having it vertical uh, because in the application I'm using it for on a garden tractor I'm just kind of improvising something but this this piece of hardware is perfect for what I want to do and <clears throat> so as you can see it um, it will fold up in the vertical position and go down horizontally for normal towing or carrying of um, of the basket or you know whatever you need to uh, carry uh, with a 500 pound weight capacity uh, so this this product arrived today and <clears throat> I was really disappointed in the fact that it did not fit together properly the product itself as it's marketed as the photographs show in the um, in the listing on Amazon <clears throat> is perfect uh, that's what I want I want that product but that's not what got delivered and I also noticed that in the reviews and I noticed that today when I <clears throat> when I went on Amazon to double check the photographs to make sure that I understood how this was supposed to be put together uh, I noticed that in the reviews there were a number of bad reviews for the project for the product and um, I don't always look at those when I order a product because uh, it seems like even with the best products, there's somebody that's disgruntled about something, one thing or another. <clears throat> and I saw a few good reviews, so I, so I ordered it. But, you know, one guy says, don't buy this crap. Another guy says, don't buy this cheap Chinese quality. Uh, somebody else says this item is right on track for tw with 2020. Terrible product. Does not come as advertised. Uh, and specifically what I saw in the in the product is that there are three holes in the receiver hitch uh, the smaller section and those holes are supposed to line up so that you can swing it up vertically or uh, fold it down horizontally and there's a um, I guess it's a 5 8 pin uh, that goes in there that works either way and there's a bolt that goes through that holds it in there permanently and the bolt has a nylon <clears throat> section in there so that <clears throat> it cannot vibrate loose and uh, <clears throat> you know seems well designed in that way but I noticed that not only did the holes not line up and you can see uh, I measured them in uh, with a caliper and uh, after I saw they didn't fit just to just to document what the actual measurements are you can see them here and when it's in the vertical position just the hole does not line up at all it just is not anywhere near it uh, in the down horizontal position uh, the hole that the pin goes through is pretty close but not not perfect and therefore the pin cannot go through the holes uh, so it's ridiculous that either way it, it's up there, either way it's mounted, it just doesn't fit. And then to add insult to injury, the bolt uh, that comes with the unit is too short. You can see it barely sticks out once it's put into the unit and the bolt just sort of catches uh, and you can kind of turn it, maybe half turn, whatever it is and uh, that's as tight as it gets and so the bolt does not engage with the nylon in the nut and so it's pretty useless uh, the bolt and nut combination and um, anyway that's it just very disappointing I'm going to contact Amazon uh, I made an 
an order about two months ago that just never came and um, had to get on the phone with Amazon and they have great customer service. I mean, people pick up, um, everybody's working at home, so you, you know, it takes a little bit longer um, to get a hold of people maybe before then compared to before the coronavirus. But I uh, had good experience explaining to them that a product never arrived. They, they gave me a quick refund and shipped out another product. So I've had good experience calling them. I'm going to return this product. Um, I almost don't want to because it's like I, I, I wish the product w- was just what it, what it was advertised for. So I don't know if I can get a replacement that actually works. And I don't know if anybody at Amazon is in a position to do the quality control to see that the product actually is manufactured correctly. Uh, based on the number of negative reviews I've seen on Amazon for the product and everybody's saying the same thing that has a negative review, that the holes don't even line up. It's trash. Holes don't line up. Um, another guy said bought two. They both came completely defective. The holes for the pin were drilled completely in the wrong place. Uh, so things like this. Another guy says junk. The bolt holes are misdrilled and can't accommodate both pin and bolt when folded to 90 degrees. And uh, he, he all, this guy also says that the bolt is too short and only shows two threads. Bolt was also cut crooked. Now, I didn't see the bolt that was crooked, but anyway. Um, but it definitely is too short. So with all these negative reviews explaining what the defect of, is of the product... And this is this goes back like six months. Some of these reviews, um, well, January so of twenty twenty, and then another one from May, June, June, June. Uh, so anyway, Amazon's seeing the reviews, but I don't know if these people that have the negative reviews if they're actually taking the time to <clears throat> return the product. And I think if Amazon doesn't get a return for the product, they they may not they. They're just ignoring the reviews, I guess. I don't know. Uh, so I'm going to return the product. Uh, I'm sure I'll get a refund, but I hope I can actually buy the correct product because I want it. This is perfect for what I need, for what I'm doing. I'll be making another video on uh, the um, the application that I'm using on a garden tractor. I've got kind of a neat thing that I'm putting together. And uh, this will be perfect for what I need. So anyway, just wanted to give you that update. If you have any um, any experience with this product, whether good or bad, uh, just definitely leave it in the comments below. If you have a question, uh, you know, ask it. I will. I try to keep up with my um, my YouTube account with anybody that has comments or questions. Uh, as much as I'm able to, I will answer your questions. Uh, so that's all for now. Thanks for watching.